Hi, I'm Dick Foster, and on today's edition of This Zoned House, we're here in Bluffton, South Carolina, with a homeowner who's going to do an energy efficient upgrade on their new home. What we're going to do is foam the attic, and then instead of having two units control the heating and the air conditioning, we're going to replace two heat pumps, put in one heat pump, and a three zone, zone first damper system. So let's show you how it's done. Hi, we're out up in the attic where we replaced two three ton heat pumps and put in one four ton. We were able to downsize the heat pump because we foamed the attic. And one of the other things is we've added zones to the house too. We've zoned off the living room and the kitchen from the master bedroom on the first floor and then also a second floor third zone for the kids. Dave, I see you've installed our zoning panel and our bypass eliminator. Absolutely. We, uh, it was nice and easy with the plug and play uh, dampers. All we do is use a phone cord, as you know, but for those of you that don't out there, zoning can be difficult with the wiring. Super easy with the plug and play. Um, we've dampered, uh, we've daisy chained two dampers together to get one zone, even though we have two separate uh, duct trunk lines, but it went together smoothly. And we also have the bypass eliminator on there. That allows us to not have a bypass duct that you sometimes see uh, in zoning applications, which eliminates some extra duct work, especially in an area where we're tight like we are here. Well, that's great. The bypass eliminator does eliminate the separate bypass where we bleed any excess air into the zones that are not calling. On our BPE eliminator here, we have a little digital display that always monitors the pressure. We can adjust the static pressure and bleed air into those closed zones. The BPE also allows us to monitor the damper positions at all times. In addition to the panel, we've got dampers with the LEDs on here to show you the damper positions, either red for closed, or in this case right now, green for open as the system is just satisfied. So a really neat installation done by Superior Heating and Cooling using our zone dampers, plug-in uh, damper motors, and the BPE eliminator. Okay, so what we got going on here is Bernard is in the process of cutting out one of the air conditioning systems for the house. When he's done with that, he's gonna cut out the second air conditioning that's doing the second floor. What we're gonna do is replace both of these uh, systems with one system of the correct size. The difference being that these systems work at 100% capacity all the time. So no matter what, you're getting full output out of each one of these air conditioners. When we get rid of them and replace them with one uh, modulating system, what we're going to do is have a system that'll ramp up and down based on the needs of the house. So if we only need one ton of air conditioning, we're only gonna get one ton. If we need four tons, we're gonna get four tons. But the whole idea is that 90% of the time, we do not need 100% of capacity except for the very hot days of the summer. So this system will know that and run at those smaller sizes or smaller capacities, therefore saving energy uh, all year round. We're here back at the Lockhart House in Bluffton, South Carolina, and we're gonna to talk to Jenny, who's the homeowner, and she's going to tell us how her heating and air conditioning system problems were resolved and how well the installation went and really how she feels today versus what happened previously. Jenny, yes. you had some issues with your heating and air conditioning system previously. We had a lot of issues with our heating and air. Uh, we had two units. There was a major temperature difference between downstairs and upstairs. Um, our children's rooms are upstairs, so you, if it was either freezing cold if the air was blowing or stuffy and hot if it wasn't blowing. And so we were constantly adjusting the temperature to try to make it comfortable. The same was happening downstairs. And it was a, a lot of effort and a lot of thinking about something that you don't really want to spend time thinking about. Right. You know? Right. So you contacted Superior Heating and yes. Air Conditioning and Dave Miller came out. Amazing. And we did kind of a whole house approach for you. you we did. added insulation. They foamed the attic, mm -hmm. which allowed us to reduce the capacity of the heating and the cooling. Right. You had six tons of air conditioning with two separate units. Mm -hmm. We've now put in one unit that only has four tons. Right. And in addition to just ch reducing the unit size, you also are able to reduce the electrical load because you only need 30 amps versus having 60 amps for those two units. That's right. Then, of course, Dave added zoning where we zoned. Right. Not only you had two zones before, but now what did we get? Three. Three Got zones, three. which you wouldn't think would make such a difference. It makes a huge difference. Uh, I'm a raving fan of the zones because 
I can have my bedroom cold. I like to sleep with it cold at night, but I can have my living room warm and comfy if I want to watch TV and be comfortable. Um, and then our children's temp the temperature in their room never changes. We don't have those big swings in temperature from when the air is blowing and when it's not blowing. Um, so it's been a remarkable improvement. I mean, I haven't touched the thermostat since you guys left. It's amazing. We, and except for in the beginning, we had to turn it up. Mm -hmm. You know, we used to have to keep it down 70 degrees, you know, 71 degrees. Now I think our baseline temperature is like 78 or 79. Oh, that's great. Um, the energy bills are lower. You know, the it's just I, I can't emphasize enough how what an improvement is to our quality of life when it's something you don't really think about that much. You know, I don't think a lot of people contemplate their HVAC, but you should because there's a world of improvement to be had. Absolutely. Again, heating and air conditioning could be 70% of your utility bill. Yes. But when done right, we can actually reduce that, as Jamie said. Yeah, 30, 40%. You know, 30 to 40%, yeah. and even during the peak summer days. So you're a satisfied customer. I, I am a raving fan. I am beyond a satisfied customer. I'm a raving fan. It was a spectacular. The whole thing was a great experience. And it saved you and your husband from having to go to marriage counseling. It did, exactly. Right? I mean, exactly. who knew? That was the root of every problem. So. Exactly. So, well, great. Well, thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. And uh, that's it from Zone First. And uh, again, zoning can be a good problem solver. It can save your marriage. That's right. Thank you.